Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 45, and this is war number six. We're halfway through the season. And we're going up against an alliance called Dioses Latinos. I hope I didn't say anything naughty. But let's see who they banned. All right. They banned McQuicksilver. I was just starting to uh, like using him. They banned Hercules and they banned Silk. And we've got Titania and Hulk globally banned, but that does free up uh, a few others. Uh, so, eh, we can work with it. All right, let's see who they have here. Oops. And uh, formulate our plan. Okay. Gallon. That looks like gallon food, unless uh, Viv Vision, uh, if there's something uh, funny I don't know about her on that node, it looks like gallon should eat her alive. Same thing with that Colossus. Um, let's see, section two. All right. Um, hmm. Now, if these were reversed... I'd know who I wanted to, to bring in. And we saw what happened when I tried to bring in um, Magneto. I don't know why I was taking that damage. I shouldn't have been taking that damage as far as I understood it, but I was. So I need to bring somebody else in for him. And I do know a little bit better how to fight him. So we'll see. I don't really, I'm trying to think of a good counter for him on that node. Um, anyone that's bleed immune or doesn't take damage from bleed that can uh, handle him. So I will talk about that. Um, it may be that I end up using Corvus. Um, I don't really want to use Corvus uh, on that node, but... I may end up doing that, all right? And then this one over here, Nova, hmm. I don't think Nova gets an armor up, does he? I don't remember um, him getting an armor up. If he doesn't get an armor up, then I'm bringing Claire. Yeah, because if he doesn't get an armor up, then you don't have to worry about the node. And you can just bring in somebody that is good for him. So, uh, Gallon, so far, uh, Claire. And what we've been doing is we've been securing our path first and then one of the officers has been looking at our team and then deciding, you know, if we have somebody that's good uh, for it. And I can see here, look at this. Is it everyone? No, everyone except that uh, Hulkling. So if I bring Claire, yeah, they may assign me to that Hulkling. So that might work. Um, I don't think they'll assign me any of these unless I were to bring in another. So uh, Claire and Gallon and someone for that Ant-Man. And it will probably end up being um, Corvus. But I might bring in a Terax as well that might work also so we'll see i'll i'll uh talk about it and see what they say but yeah let me see this one all right that's incinerate poison so those are the hazard shifts so not claire not gallon corvus could do this one but i wouldn't use him against um that uh, doom. 
and definitely want to decay attacker. I can see why they uh, banned Silk and um, Quicksilver. But, all right. So, Claire, Gallon, and Corvus, maybe. All right, let's get on with the fighting. All right, we're going in with Gallon, my girl Claire, and Magneto. Now, this season has been pretty rough for uh, my alliance. We normally do way better than this, but um, the meta, the bands, it's causing us to have to really uh, change some things up. And of course you have the holidays as well, but we're capable of better. We're definitely capable of better. Um, and hopefully we'll be able to come back from this. So I went in here with Gallon because he's the safe option. All right. All I got to do is basically do some nice little five hit combos. And once I can get to my special after a heavy, it's over with. Now I thought about countering him there, but I was like, nah, let's play it safe. Nice parry, heavy. Special, done. Don't have to worry about any shenanigans or anything like that. Now, in this case, the heavy did not do that little delay that I often see it doing when I play Gallon, especially. It went pretty well. Now, this next one, you know Viv Vision gets a lot of armor ups. And that could be a problem, except with Gallon, because Gallon likes it when they get lots of armor ups beautiful more that all right so here we go look at his um charges going up just doing regular combos now i stopped and hesitated there because i didn't want her firing her special one because it's annoying all right there you go got the heavy bam and done that's gallon for you they they put Folks that get lots of armor ups, gallon food. Yummy, yummy, yummy. All right. So no problems there. The only thing I was worried about was her special one, which I have evaded fully before. But I'm still not comfortable evading her special one. The timing on especially the last part seemed extra long to me. But anyway, now, y'all remember this fight? Do you remember when I fought with um, Magneto before against an Ant-Man right here? I want y'all to watch this fight. All right, so if you don't know, Magneto does get 90% uh, potency reduction on bleed and I believe shock. I also have Coagulate. However, I noticed that I was getting um, damage anyway from the bleed. Uh, one of my uh, friends online, uh, Jay Will, said that I need Pacify. And I know Pacify would be great, but I don't agree that it's needed. And I do not have it here. And I want y'all to watch this fight. Look at how this fight goes, okay? Very different from the first fight that you saw me do. Because now I got his number, okay? And I don't remember if I was um, using my uh, maxed out. Look at that. It's always some shenanigans, but that's why I have the um, indestructible. Because I knew there was going to be some shenanigan that happened and I was going to get hit. I just knew it. All right. So here we go. That was 39 right there. So here we go. Crunchy, crunchy. Boom. Now, compare that fight with the fight from before. But 
I have now lost enough to Ant-Man future that I'm getting used to uh, fighting with him, uh, fighting him, I should say. So that's about as, as good as I could get. See, I, I sat back just to enjoy that fight. Now, we've got Nova. Magneto can do this fight as well. But Nova doesn't really get any armor ups. If I remember correctly, he might. But it won't matter. Because my girl Claire is who I decided to use against Nova. She has always been a great Nova counter. Now, the only thing that would have been bad, because she has no defense against shock, if he got an armor up and she could not nullify it and got shock, that's when it would have been a bad idea. Okay, but as you can see, there's no armor up and she's just doing her thing. Now, I didn't cycle and I could have cycled here um, that first time and this time as well. Don't ask me why I didn't. Yep, we good there. But look, look at him, he's going down. And I'm just blocking him. No need to, to do anything else. And here we go. Hit him with it. Boom. And that's that. Easy peasy. So section one and two is now done. Uh, I didn't have anyone that was great for taking out any of the minis. So uh, I didn't get assigned a mini. But I was there for like backup if needed. All right, so we're going to take a brief intermission and we'll be back and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back. And as you can see, we won this war and we need to keep winning because we are in serious danger of being in Platinum 3 which I know would disappoint a lot of people. All right, so here we go. Shout out to our MVPs, always putting it down. And we we won pretty handily uh, in this one here. All right, so that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Take care, hit the like button, and you all have a blessed day.